behalf of all of the State Fair Board and all the good guys from WIFE, may I present the Beatles! It's hard to believe that nearly 50 years have passed since that incredible day when I was honored to introduce the Beatles in their only Indiana appearance right here at the Fairgrounds Coliseum. From 1939 through the middle 70s, the Fairgrounds Coliseum was the place to be. And not just when the Beatles came to town. This wonderful old building was the premier gathering spot in Indianapolis for everything from professional hockey to presidential speeches. In its hour of maximum danger, I do not shrink from this responsibility. I welcome it. Indianapolis and Indiana have been shaken by the worst tragedy in their history. An explosion and fire last night at the State Fairgrounds Coliseum has claimed between 65 and 70 lives. Los Angeles couldn't stop Mel Daniels. And Indiana won the first game, 109 to 93. Ladies and gentlemen, girls and boys, children of all ages, welcome to the all-new Marab Shrine Circus. The best way to protect the homeland is to hunt down anybody who would do harm to Americans and bring them to justice to precisely what we're going to do. Governor of Indiana. To the best of my skill and ability. To the best of my skill and ability. So help you God. Help me go. The Pepsi Coliseum holds many memories for myself and my entire family. And when I think about those memories, I can't help but, but get a huge smile on my face and, and a beam of joy in my heart. Well, many of the good times I had here were with my father. My father was a professional musician, and he had a close relationship with Sonia Henney. I recall one time uh, meeting Sonia Henney, and that was uh, quite a trip for a kid. All these years later, kids are still making memories at the Coliseum. Kids like Andrew Fralick, who has grown up playing hockey in the Pepsi Coliseum, just like his dad. When I got my first goal, I was like, I was almost crying. I was so happy because it was like overwhelmingly fun and I loved it. It reminds me a lot of when I grew up because I grew up playing here in the 70s. It's easy for me to come back here and relive a lot of memories with my son. That's been really neat for me. The memories are cherished, but time has caught up to the Coliseum. Safety and operational issues threaten its availability. It needs ADA upgrades and modern equipment to better serve the public and operate more efficiently. A renovated Coliseum will keep its classic Art Deco appearance on the outside, but on the inside, it will have a whole new look and feel. The main lobby will be spacious and open with additional ticket windows to reduce lines. Visitors will travel up to the main concourse with its wide halls and modern concession stands. The new design will allow views down into the arena. Inside the seating bowl, the restored glass block and new lighting system will illuminate the building like never before. A new overhead scoreboard and an updated sound system will also enhance the spectator experience. For rodeo and equestrian events, the Coliseum's unique concrete wall will be rebuilt. Competitors say that's what makes it one of the best facilities in North America. Adjoining the Coliseum on its south side, a new smaller arena with its own separate access will allow year-round opportunities for public skating, hockey, or shows and other events while the Coliseum is also in use. Well it's going to be very exciting because it's going to be bigger and better but it's also going to keep the integrity of the Coliseum. It's going to keep that tradition going but yet here's going to be a beautiful venue that's going to be available to people all year long. I think people sometimes just think about it as something that's used during the 17 days of the fair but it's really a very big part of the fairgrounds all year long. And I think we're going to be seeing a lot more people when they're trying to come up with a place for an event, they're going to think of the new Coliseum. The new Coliseum complex will be a place where a new generation of Hoosiers makes lifelong memories. Where the community continues to gather for historic events 
and where young showmen and athletes hone their skills as they reach for their dreams. NHL. That's where I want to go. And I'll remember these days when I played here. The Coliseum campaign is important to all Hoosiers. We hope that we can count on your support.